and I'm going to be showing you how to make this little power pot. Um, another one compared to the one that I did the other day. This one's slightly shallower and it measures 3 inch by 3 inch and it should be about 3 inch down as well. It's so perfect if you're putting them in a seed tray. The paper I'm going to be using, I've cut mine to 22 inch by 11 inch. This will work with a standard size yeah. paper but um, I myself like to keep it so it goes 3 inch by 3 inch. So let's get started. First thing is the same with the last one is fold directly over and then once you've done that same thing again fold directly over trying to be as neat as possible so once you've done that you take the part of the top not the part that's got the flappy bits the part up here and then you fold it to that center line there and then exactly the same with the other side fold it to that center line there and then once you've got this place it like this and take the top sheet of this just the one sheet and line that with there and then fold over once again over to there Okay, so now you flip this over and then you take these sides here and get them back to the centre. Back to the centre line, sorry, be more specific. Put them back to the centre line there. And then once you've done that, exactly the same on the other side. So you have that, and then on this side, you take it over one, up to that line there, and then fold it over once again, till it near enough matches the top of the other one, and you have like a little boat thing. So, the next step is the bit that you flap there, you've got to tuck that into the back bit there, where you've got the two flaps at the back there so this can be quite fiddly so it might take a bit of getting used to doing it once you've done it a few times as you can see it's quite easy so if you can see that it's tucked in there now give that a quick flatten down and then fold over your top bit turn it over fold over once again and then you take the side that has the flappy bits inside there fold it over and then you take this corner bottom corner and fold it to that corner so you just fold that over there once and then you only fold it the crease to see where you get to that other line you fold it just there and then when you pick this up you hold the line there and then if you put your fingers in and open that up the line that you just creased will naturally want to fold in to the bottom to make a base and I'll just pinch these sides in for you and there you go if you can see that that is the perfect little paper pot these are 3 inch by 3 inch as I say as the one that I showed just perfect for starting your seeds in and they um, they make rows neatly I use these for my corn so, just a quick video on how you make those. I hope it's useful to at least one person. If it is, that would be greatly um, I'll make my day. If just one person finds it helpful. So, that's it for today. And as usual, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.